Hello and welcome to Cornish Walking Trails. Today we're in Patree. We've come to Patreeth today. It's been in the news this week after Storm Eleanor ripped through the harbour wall. In Portreeth, a 30-foot section of the harbour wall was washed away this morning and police and Cormac workers are now on the scene. So we've got some footage taken from this point previously. Let's have a look. We thought we'd come and see what was going on. Oh, it's people with yellow jackets on and hats. Oh, they're going to do something, Sarah. Do you think they're going to fix it today? So here we have the sea at Patreeth today. Still some big breakers coming in, looking fantastic. The harbour wall that dates back well, a couple of hundred years. And it comes up there is the breach. You can see some diggers. Got a big lorry, some other vehicles in the car park. I think they've been dancing on that sand and they diggers. I mean pretty patterns in the sand, aren't they? They're happy. <laughs> Let's go down and investigate then, see what's going on. Oh good idea. So this is the innermost harbour, full of seaweed ripped off the seafloor. Seaweed is just strewn everywhere. High tide. Gosh. It's quite a hole, isn't it? Big hole, isn't it? I reckon about 40 foot. I think the power of that wave's hitting that, so take that down. I don't think I would like to have been living in those properties when it went. It must have been quite a loud bang. Diggers on the beach, Sarah. Mm -hmm. There they are, look. Colin Higgs from Portreath Harbour Committee told us what happened. Well, what's happened is the wall at the end of the car park, which is by the steps down to the waterfront pub and the little beach, as it is known locally, has collapsed downwards onto what used to be the crazy golf course. There's about a 30-foot section of wall gone, maybe 40 foot. So it looks like they're in the process of rebuilding the wall. Lots of discussions going on there. Hey, look at all the sand on the car park. Yeah, it's quite a hole. We've noticed that the Surf Life Saving Club has um, been undermined a little bit. I'm going to get a bit of footage of that for you as well. That seems to be quite a lot of damage in Patrice. So that looks like they're offloading some concrete reinforcement. Oh, hello. <laughs> Just had my hand licked. <laughs> oh, 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 it is tight. Ooh. River riding high. That river looks quite swollen, doesn't it? So that gives you a little flavour of the damage left by Eleanor. Right, we're going back to the car now. 